Join me as we turn a vintage farmhouse high chair into a sentimental family heirloom to be given by a mother to her daughter. I start the project with a good cleaning and a light sanding. I decided to strip and reseal the tray and footrest so the beautiful wood grain would remain, but with a refreshed look. A medium toned stain gives the piece a nice contrast. The tray was sealed with a food safe top coat since many grandchildren will be using this at grandma's house in the years to come. The seat and legs were painted with clean white chalk paint from Dixie Bell. To add to the sentiment, grandma hand wrote the names and birth dates of her children and grandchildren. I did an image transfer process with a color laser printer, the backing sheets of a page of shipping labels, and some Mod Podge. The process is simple. Apply a thin layer of transfer medium and quickly place your printed image face down directly onto the transfer medium before it dries. It is important to carefully smooth out the paper with a dry brush or a brayer. I added a heavy book to keep it from developing wrinkles overnight and checked it frequently. The next morning, I simply peeled the backing off and the pretty little lamb remained adhered to the seat back. The same process was used to add the names to the underside of the high chair seat. I slightly distressed the edges of the high chair and the piece was waxed with Annie Sloth clear wax for a satiny and durable finish. It was time for a photo shoot before handing this heartfelt gift to her daughter. I have no doubts this will be a cherished family piece for many years. Thanks for watching. To see more of my projects, visit me at shutterandbrushes.com.